Hey guys, Mrs. Florent Corey here with another edition of our ELA Daily Fix It. And today we are going to focus on subject verb agreement, specifically on your quill assignment. So if you don't know what I am talking about at all, please make sure you are checking your Google Classroom every day because your teachers are posting your assignments. And one of your assignments this week is on a platform called Quill, Q-U-I-L-L. -L, and you can find that on Clever. So on Clever, you click the button that says Quill. It's gonna bring you to a page. You're gonna have some assignments. So this week is your second assignment on Quill. If you have not done either assignment, make sure you do both of them. Last week's assignment was on the difference between there, there, and there. This week, your assignment is on subject verb agreement. So what that means is if you've ever heard a sentence before, something like we is going to the park, we is the subject, is is the verb. But does that make sense? Does that sound right? We is going to the park? No. Is is incorrect. Is does not match with the subject we. Are. We are going to the park. We is plural, so are needs to be plural. The subject and the verb agreement. So that's going to be our focus this week on Quill. So I'm going to show you a page from Quill. And you're gonna see that the sentence says, our friend works or work really hard. Friend is the subject, and then works or work is going to be our verb, our action. So friend, it's only one friend, that means it is singular. So we want the verb to agree with that. One helpful trick is, if your subject does not have an S, the verb is typically going to have an S. So, our friend works really hard. That sounds like it goes together. But let's check with work. Our friend work really hard. It just doesn't work. Ha ha ha. So, our friend works really hard. So I'm gonna type that exactly as I see it with the correct verb in the box below. And please make sure you are adding punctuation. There is a period at the end of that sentence, so make sure you add the period at the end of the sentence. So guys, make sure you are signing into your Google Classroom every single day. Make sure that you are signing into Quill and make sure you are doing your assignments. And if you haven't already, make sure you log into Lexia. Meet those Lexia minutes. We're going to be looking. If your Lexia minutes for the week are only at 20, you only have to do 20 minutes for the whole week. So make sure you're signing in. Make sure you hit your Lexia minutes. And make sure you're going on to Mayon. You have some assignments in Mayon. I know Miss Simos is posting videos about that. Miss Elen is posting videos about your math assignments. And remember, math is on Tuesday and Thursday. So we miss you all so, so much. Make sure you have subscribed. Make sure that you are checking your videos. Check your Google Classroom every single day. And uh, get on to Quill and do your subject verb agreement assignment.